So the idea for Four Corners came from a brother after I'd been travelling around the world and we decided we'd open something that brings a few of those uh, flavours back to Tilsley. Something a bit different for the area rather than try and be in a carbon copy of everything else. Um, for that reason we, we opened with a sort of worldwide menu with a bit of local stuff thrown in. Callum's fitted in very well. He's, uh, he's become a very useful team member after many months as an apprentice. He's part of the team, he's part of the family that makes up the business. And yeah, I, I, you know, I couldn't be happy with how he's integrated into our business. As a business, we always look at cost and benefit and how things are going to pan out for us. Um, those tests have been met by taking on Callum as an apprentice. We get to mould somebody into what we need at the same time they get to um, experience other environments through the college, which make them a more rounded individual. Well, actually, it works very well for us. We find that Jamie or other staff from the college can attend here uh, by appointment, uh, carry out their assessments, any in-house training that we need to do. Similarly, Callum's time at the college also integrates quite well with what we do as a business. So it's a, it's a useful union between the college and the business providing the training for Callum. As the training advisor, um, we we're looking after the employer and the apprentice. Um, we need to make sure that the apprentice is learning the skills required by the, the employer and then obviously we need to make sure that the apprentice is learning the skills required to progress within the industry um, if, if they want to make that career um, and move you know, on within, within case and hospitality. Callum's training towards a level 2 apprentice in food production and cooking. Um, so that, that could take him anywhere within the hotel industry, um, a la carte restaurants. So he's learning all the, the preparation skills of your, your fish, your meat, your vegetables, your pastry skills, learning all the cooking skills required. And then obviously the, 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 the fine and finishing skills he's going to need to progress. Successful certainly is the word I'd use to describe it. It's been useful, successful, it's been efficient and it's been quite, um, what's the word, it's been uh, very well rounded so that the areas that we can't provide training for in-house are taken care of by the college. My advice to other businesses considering joining a similar scheme would be to look at the cost implications, be aware that there's financial help available in some cases and to really look at it seriously because it's been great help to us it's good for the area if the young people are getting proper training and employment, um, so I think everybody wins if it's done well. I'd recommend an apprenticeship because earning a wage at the same time as learning is ideal for someone at my age. If anyone's thinking about doing an apprenticeship, I'd, I would say to that.